Alright, what's good everybody? It's your boy Call Light. So we're finally back with some more Mugen content. As y'all know, we are in the finals, the semifinals, my bad. And we're doing One Piece versus Naruto. As y'all know, Naruto got crazy ass contenders as well as Madara Uchiha, but they're going against One Piece. One Piece has been going crazy this tournament, and a lot of people are surprised that they made it this far. But honestly, I'm not because One Piece is beginning stronger and stronger as you guys have been sending me more and more characters. But this shit is bound to be crazy. Let me know down below who do y'all got winning the entire tournament? Will it be one of these teams? Naruto and One Piece definitely have a crazy ass chance of making it to the end. But let me know down below what y'all think. I hope y'all enjoy this shit. It's your boy Call Light, so we're finally back, baby. And let's get right into the action. Alright, what's good everybody? It's your boy Call Light Soon. Y'all y'all see we're back here with another Mugen video. And today, man, we're finally back. I know today is like the second of November, and it's been a cool little minute. We got like a week of no videos and everything. As y'all know, a lot of people don't know I have been moving houses. As y'all see, I'm in a new location and everything. And that's like the new, the new vibe and everything. You feel me? So that's the whole reason why I've been gone for last week. And we're finally back with the video is going to be back on a daily upload grind and probably even double uploads because I have time on my hands right now. So I just need to get some uploads for you guys. But other than that, I just want to make sure you guys know that I'm back. And today we're obviously doing Naruto versus um One Piece. And I feel like this all together is going to be one crazy ass bit because both either way, either fan base is going to be really mad. So I don't know what to say for both teams. I like y'all know I love One Piece and I love Naruto, but those are probably my top two, but one of them has to go today. And obviously, if your team has lost, do not worry. The loser bracket is finna start. So whoever loses here has a chance to come back. The loser bracket is finna start up. So and make sure to send me your characters. If I don't have a character you want or anything like that, I heard of new Kizaru was out, but I do not have the character. Like I can't find him or anything. So make sure to send them to me if you guys want me to use them in a future video. But I was starting with Shanks versus Naruto, the two strongest people are basically close to the two strongest people because y'all know we have Madara and Whitebeard still. But I know for a fact Shanks is stronger than Luffy, so. Okay. Okay. Okay, there we go. Ooh, okay. He's doing the damage he needs to do. It's just Shanks is not doing bad right now, but Naruto, this new Naruto is Kage's Naruto. And he is a problem. Look at the damage and the tankiness he has, man. Ooh, okay, Shanks. Okay. But right now, Shanks is not doing too crazy. But y'all know he does have hockey and he has mad attacks. But this Naruto is just so good and programmed to do mad different things. Okay, so Naruto takes the first round. Not bad so far, but it's not looking good for One Piece if they're going to start off with L. I'm not going to lie. Both teams are very strong, though, as y'all know. So, this could go either way. A lot of people say the One Piece team is OP. Oh, there we go. Hockey, okay. I don't know what his hockey does. I don't know if it's a damage boost because it's not an auto dodge. There we go. That's some damage. That's crazy because this Shanks is dead almost like fan made. Because we haven't seen Shanks do anything yet in the show. So, honestly, all this stuff is like just, it is just all hockey. But it's like theory. This actually might not even be how Shanks actually fights or anything. Okay, there we go. Gama, what was that, Gama Kichi? There we go. Okay, Shanks is doing really good this round. Okay, Naruto went into his uh, KCM mode. Okay, there we go. Okay, so yeah, Naruto is doing, in this mode, I know he has a little auto dodge, which makes him a lot stronger. Okay, so he has a good amount of chakra too. Okay, Naruto's losing a little bit. Shanks is really like going crazy this fight. The only person I think that Kali could take Naruto on his team is Madara. Madara has to be on the same level Naruto is or higher. It's like he is just a problem, as y'all know. There we go, Shanks. Yo, Shanks is like, he's putting in that work right now. This is crazy. Okay, we got a little hockey attack again. I know Naruto does have one more form, I'm pretty sure. So if Shanks can take it down, then he got it. But that next form is, like, really a problem if he gets to it. 
Oh, he's about to get to it. Ooh, maybe not. Ooh, maybe not. Naruto's catching him right now. Oh, there we go. Oh, this might be his last form. Well, for this fight, that is, because he's not transforming anything. Oh, this is a close-ass match, then. He could go either way right now. Oh, hockey, there we go. But it's not helping him. His hockey, I don't know why he did that, because that hockey don't be helping him. Oh, there we go. That's some damage. That's the damage. Oh, 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 no, this is what I'm talking about, you guys. I don't even know what he's doing right now. He popped a KCM, too. Okay. It's not really helping him, though. Shanks is going crazy. Okay. Oh, my God. Now, nah, Shanks is not fair. Come on. He's, it's almost tied up right now. Yo, Shanks, you can win this, my boy. Nah, Shanks is losing. Rasengan. Oh, my God. That was a crazy-ass match. I'm sorry. I'm sorry for the Shanks fans. One Piece fans. That was a crazy-ass match. Shanks put his work in, but... As y'all see, Naruto did take the first round. Let me rate that down. All right, so Naruto is 1-0 now, you guys. Now we're going to be getting to the second fight, which is going to be Sasuke Uchiha, the Renegon one that you guys always ask me to use instead of the other one against Zoro. So I'm pretty sure the right Zoro is the one on the right. But if it's wrong, then I'm definitely going to back out immediately because I know you have to select this color off the rip. Oh, we had a little crash. I bet. Wait, actually, is it loading? Oh, I think it's resetting. But like I was saying, a lot of people have been asking me to use Renegon, um... Sasuke. So I'm that's what I'm gonna do for now on. Instead of um instead of Zoro no, instead of uh right the other Sasuke, because I feel like the other Sasuke is better and I've watched him kill Renegon Sasuke before. But everybody wants me to use this Sasuke, so we're gonna see how he goes against Zoro. I wanna see if it's color selection or not. If not, that means it's the wrong Zoro, because I know which Zoro is actually the right one or not. See, it's that's the wrong Zoro. I bet, bet, bet. Alright, so we know the Zoro that's good is the third Zoro now. At least we all know that. There we go. All right. So we got Zoro versus Sasuke, you guys. I see this debate all the time on TikTok. And I feel like this could be crazy. Zoro already starting off the rip. Y'all know how aggro he is. But Sasuke is definitely not a bad character. Especially when he has stuff like the Susano, the Susano, like the Matsuratsu. He has a lot of things in his package. Okay, so he's already armor broken. That's bad. That is not how you want to start, Sasuke. Okay, so they're both kind of... He's charging up. Sasuke, you don't want to let Sasuke get energy because you know he has that Susano. That might kill him. That might kill Sasuke off the rip right now. Oh, he's at 1% health. Oh, and Izoro takes the round. Okay. Okay. I'm not gonna lie. This Sasuke is definitely not bad. But Zoro, y'all know Zoro's on like Levi level. He's really strong. But I have seen this Sasuke beat Zoro before. Because he has... Y'all know Sasuke has the combos and everything. You just gotta let him get into it. He is a very clean looking character though. And they still... Oh yeah, I forgot the Naruto team still does have Minato too. Minato. Forgot all about that. Oh my god, Zoro's combos, I'm not gonna lie, you guys, they look so clean. Oh, there we go. Okay, Sasuke, see, this is what I'm talking about. Sasuke can beat Zoro. Look at his combos and stuff. Look at the damage he's doing. Right now, that little flame Zoro has is a burning Sasuke. Okay, there we go. We got, we got to see a little Susano. When Sasuke takes that shirt off, man, it's a whole different Sasuke. Let me just tell you guys that right now. For the people who don't know. Ooh, that might kill. No, it's not gonna kill. Oh, it's seeing Zoro takes the round. Sasuke almost had it, but he let up on his combos, and that ended up killing him. So right now, it's 1-1. One, one. We do. Now we're doing Madara versus Whitebeard. It is 1-1. One, one. We have One Piece with one dub and Naruto with one dub. We just had seen Zoro beat Sasuke, and this is the thing about both of these characters. Like, they're both going to win this shit so easily. As y'all know, look at Whitebeard's damage. It's literally unfair. Look at this. Look at the damage, you guys. But, but Madara... He still can win because y'all know he has the regeneration. So it's like strength versus regeneration, basically. It's just Whitebeard is so tanky and strong that it's like too many things on top of too many things. Like, I'll be surprised if Madara could leave today with a dub. Look at that damage. Two of those and he's dead. That's death. Oh, never mind. It's not death. That's going to hurt him. That's going to kill him. Never mind. It's not death. Yo, what? Madara, you have to transform. There we go. That move right there. Oh, my God. Look at the damage. And Majestic Flame. Okay, so literally, Whitebeard is so close. He can beat Madara easily. But he needs to put the right moves together. He can't wait. Okay, Madara is starting in Jajuriki already. Oh, my God. The damage of his punches are ridiculous, you guys. That's one thing you got to know about Madara. You do not want him to get... Not Madara, Whitebeard. You do not want Whitebeard close up on top of you. 
Oh, so he... Okay. Oh, my God. Look at this damage. Oh, nah. That was crazy. There's literally nothing you could do about that. That's not even Madara's fault. Where's my... Uh, that's what... That's literally... Not Madara. That's not even Whitebeard's fault. There's nothing he literally can do about that fight. But now we... It's 2-1 in One Piece's favor. Not One Piece. Uh, Naruto's favor. And... We're, now we have... Oh, shit, I didn't mean to start the fight. Let me uh, back out. Right, but now we have Luffy versus Pain. As y'all know, both of these characters are crazy. Luffy, the spamming demon. Y'all know he does not take any, like, he does not stop punching it. Literally, this is the thing. Luffy is really strong, but Pain, he's overpowered if you give him time. So, literally, Luffy, you gotta end the fight fast. Because if you let Pain get his clones out, Luffy's gonna lose. I can tell you that right now, you guys, from experience. I've watched this Pain fight enough times to know that if you give him bar, he beats everybody, bro. There we go. I was about to say, Luffy's playing terrible right now. All, all One Piece, not One Piece. All, yeah, all One Piece needs is, um, no, Naruto needs one more dub. So if Naruto wins here, then it's over for One Piece. Oh, that's, that's the attack you don't want to get hit by. Oh my God. You guys already know about that attack. Luffy always uses it. It's the spamming Gotling. Y'all know the, the, um, it's like the, oh, but mighty push. That's going to hurt. Oh, Luffy didn't even get hit by most of it. He got hit by half of it. Okay, so this could go either way easily right now. Luffy's doing better, though. That might, that might be game. No, that's not game, right? Ooh, that's not game. And Luffy takes round one. This might go to a, a, a fifth a fifth fight, y'all. It's 2-1 it's right now. Naruto, you need one W. You can pain clutch it. Literally, pain, all you gotta do is summon your clones, and Luffy cannot fight you, bro. It's too many people to fight. But Luffy's gonna spam. Yep, you already know. <clears throat> that's gonna hurt. Damn, bro, that attack right there is just so much damage. It's literally probably the best attack Luffy has in his arsenal. Almighty Push. Almighty Push is strong, though. But it's not, no, Luffy's godly. Okay, so it's close right now. Pain can win. He needs to summon his clones right now. But he's not doing it. He's literally not doing it. He keeps wasting his meter. That's the problem. Oh, this might be game. You already know what he's using. You already know what Luffy's using. Yep. That might be game, but it might be close to game. Oh, that's game. Okay. So right now it is 2-2, two, two, and we're going to a final round, you guys. Now we have Luffy. Luffy clutched up. Now we have Katakuri against Minato. As you know, Katakuri used to be the strongest person on the One Piece team. So this could go either way, man. This could go either way. Um, Where's my boy Katakuri? Man, Katakuri used to be the strongest on One Piece team by far. Even in the last tournament, y'all know Katakuri was the leading, like, the strongest person by far on the One Piece team. So, honestly, I don't know how I don't know how this is going to go. Where is Katakuri at? Oh, there he is. I see him. Right, so, let me know down below, before we even get into this fight, who, who y'all voted for? Because I feel like this could go crazy. Right, as y'all know, I did get the other, the you, know, you already know about the new Minato, the one with uh, KCM. But, okay, this is going to be crazy. And All right, so we got Minato against Katakuri. The final battle it is 2-2. Two -two. I'm not going to lie. This shit is getting crazy already. Y'all know Minato literally has the speed to beat Katakuri by far. But Katakuri has the strength. Yeah, Look at that damage cool. he's going to do. Oh, my God. Look at that damage. Literally, Katakuri could be kill Minato with two, two three hits. But Ka Minato has the speed. And he does do damage. Oh, that's going to hurt. Okay, that did some damage. That wasn't terrible. Oh, and Katakuri can't charge no more. He don't got to worry about those two OP attacks. Minato is too fast for Katakuri. Literally. Katakuri is strong, though. Look, he catches him. Look at the damage he does off of just catching him, you guys. This could either easily go either way. This easily could go either way. Minato, you're going to want to transform him. Minato does have KCM. Without KCM, he's yeah, he can't beat Katakuri. He's not being Katakuri without KCM. He literally gets caught, and it's over. Because... Katakuri just does that much damage. They're both charging up. Oh, he tried to sneak Minato, but Minato see it coming. I'm telling you, Minato is just too fast. And his KCM, he's even faster. So I feel like in KCM, I feel like in KCM, he's way too fast for Katakuri. Nah, you don't want to let Minato charge Katakuri because he can transform. I do want to see if he goes KCM today because I want to see it because we haven't got to see it a lot in these last couple of videos. Minato is just teleporting around. What's going on? Is this a strategy? 
He has a clone out, but the clone oh the clone's charging for him. That's OP. Yo, his clone is dead ass in the back just charging up, which is which is good, but he's not really helping. I'd I'd rather him be fighting. Ooh! Oh my god, his clone's just his clone's just mashing up charge. What's going on? Oh, a double Rasengan? Oh, that's fire. Into a KCM. Okay, we got we get, we're looking at KCM, you guys. At, th at this point, he's too fast. He can't lose. He's too fast in KCM. Double Rasengan. Game. Oh my god, yo. Minato, Minato is literally he's overpowered. When he, when he uses his like when he uses everything he needs to use, he's literally better than Kata Curry. But Kata Curry, he's damaged and everything. His output is just too crazy. Oh, he dodged the attack that he needed to dodge. Okay, Minato's actually playing decent right now. You might want to summon another clone, Minato. I'm not going to lie. That clone came in crazy clutch. Bro, this could go either way. It's 1-1, one, one, you guys. We're going into the final round right now. Okay. Yo, they're both playing really good right now. All right, level 1. Level 2. Damn, how much damage does that charge up do? Yo, oh, nah. Katakuri's walking through our Sengans. I'm telling you, Minato, Transformers over. I want to see a longer fight. I'm not trying to see no two-second fight. Oh, that's game. That's game. Oh, that's he's taking all his chakra away. Okay, Katakuri cannot use any energy no more. That's going to hurt him a lot. And he used KCM. Okay, KCM. Okay, what's going on? Oh, no, nah, this might be over. It might be over for Katakuri. He's stuck. Look, it's just hurting him. He's paralyzed. Oh, nah. I'm sorry, Katakuri. And Minato... Takes the final round. Oh, nah, that was a crazy ass fight. Literally, he had three bars. Katakuri could have ended it, but Minato cut off all of his chakra. He literally played the cards perfectly. As y'all know, Naruto did take the W. I'm sorry. The one it was 2-2 and they went into the final round. But as y'all know, One Piece will be in the loser bracket. They are not gone for good. But I hope y'all enjoyed your boy Call So as y'all know, we're back. Feel me? We're back with crazy shit. I'm sorry if your team lost. Like I said, they'll be back in the loser bracket. It was a good-ass match. We had crazy-ass fights going back and forth. And as y'all know, ISO gang, we out here.